For 200 years, my family lived in the village of Aldersby. It was a simple life, but honest. We worked the land, we paid our tithe, raised children, and praised Lumea as all good folks should. It was safe, peaceful, an illusion that shattered when the plague came. It was unseen, insidious, all pervasive. Nothing the apothecaries tried availed us, nor did the prayers of our priest. Half the village dead within the fortnight. Where was Lumea then? But even that pale next to the horrors that were yet to come. They came in the dead of night, the disease-ridden creatures that were once our loved ones and friends, all united by a single purpose, to hunt and to kill until no living being remained in Aldersby. We were not warriors, but we fought with everything we had, pitchforks, clubs, scythes, our bare hands when we had to. But it was no use. For every one of us lost, the undead gained another monster to their ranks. Then they came. The Knights of the Sacred Order, men and women sworn to the service of Lamea above all else. In all my years, I had never seen anyone fight like that. They were a storm of blades and fury, like the wrath of the goddess made manifest. The battle was swift and bloody. Before nightfall, the last of the undead burned upon great pyres. We were ecstatic. The Knights of Legend came to deliver us from evil. As one, we fell to our knees and gave praise to our saviors. If only we had known. Wherever I turn, I see naught but weakness and sin and corruption. There is nothing pure left in these lands, not a soul worthy of Lumea's light. Rejoice in your salvation. Lumea's light brings life and warmth. It guides us. It banishes the terrors of night. Yet its fury burns like the blazing heart of the sun, and woe betide all those found wanting beneath its unforgiving gaze.